Hi everyone, it's Cupcake. Hi YJ, hi home team, hi everybody. It's awesome my mom's birthday, so I feel like this is the most appropriate time to kind of get everything that I need to do started. I've set everything up for my reaction video and to just thank YJ, okay? So I have candles, I have, this is like mock cocktails, grapefruit seltzer, coconut water, and raspberry juice. And then I'm burning three sticks of incense for him, three sticks for his family, and then three for all the people who love him, which those people are too numerous to name. And when I'm generous with my praise to him, it's for a very specific reason. So let me take a drink. <laughs> Um, of my mocktail. This is a poem that I wrote back like in January and it's about a phase in my life back in 2012, 13, and 14. Um, it's a poem called Be Sun True, a poem for the white man, my plug, my true. And before I even play anything, I just want to make it clear that, you know, this is not my plug for like narcotics. In the state of Michigan, we have now fully legal marijuana. And back when this poem, the time period that this poem was referencing, we had legal marijuana. And I was in that game very, very heavy, fully legal, and just kind of working the broad expanse of the laws that we have. So. Like, as I recall that time, it was really beautiful, but it was also super tragic. And quite frankly, you know, most people wouldn't understand this, but I'm just lucky to be alive. And the person that this poem is about, he's lucky to be alive. And the people that we loved, still love, they're lucky to be alive. This poem was written in like three and a half minutes. I was working on an essay and I, I was just kind of like getting blocked with all the things that I needed to say in the context of the essay. So I was like, screw this. Let me just take a couple minutes out and let me just draft a poem. Because sometimes that'll get you like back on track, you know. So it came out in like three and a half minutes. I think I edited it for a total of like a minute and a half twice. And that was it and it was done. So I gave the poem to YJ because he asked, you know, do you have any poems or anything like that? And I just want to say that if somebody came to me and they said, you can give this poem to anybody, who are you going to give it to to do something with? That's exactly who I would have picked. So it's like, this isn't like step one to, to get to two, to get to three or whatever. Like, this is where I would have planted it. And so he worked with it, and this is what he came up with. And I have not listened to this. Two of my friends have. <laughs> and they're like, man, I'm like playing that in my car everywhere I go. So, and that's how we feel about all of his stuff. You know, for me, this is like beautiful and painful and real and synchronistic and, and bad all at the same time. So, and I'm certain that he's made something glamorous and spectacular and melodic and heavenly out of the whole thing okay oh boy here we go okay good here we go talk to him be so true a poem for the white man my old plug this isn't fate or a slow moving train this is bullet pulpit number destiny with the hands of time tied to big bars Step in my car, bring the goods, let me see the clock. This money is just a number, it's broken bones in a splint. Yeah, I parked the car, got out and checked the time. Can't be late to this situation that's on my mind. Oh my God. Meeting with the faculty to count this chicken, all I really wanted was a portion. I hope there's nothing missing. Round table discussion, the town, that's the cornice. Apartments built like a fortress, I hope there's not a shortage. What's next? Got my little portion, I'm thinking, where's the rest? This is not what I planned, I am not impressed. 
bet that Play me once, I bet that won't happen twice Fucking with this money, you play with life Bitch, don't roll the dice Who's next? I'm walking back to the car as I ponder Got this sort of just grill, I can't take it much longer Talk to him You don't decide, we are bashed You don't just fall, we are all born screaming If you do time on your head, your heart will hit the dirt Chaos is the force that twists us like two birds in a wire. Send me swimming so far out at night. Stop this sea. Stop this life. Start the car and start to think how could I infiltrate. Gotta think calculated. I ain't trying to get sent up stay. Uh, but they oh. took food off my plate. Moves full of hate. Should've never moved with these snakes. Moved on the break. Sitting at the red light. Wait for a couple days. Let you feel my rage. They gon' feel my plight. They like catch him at sun up, seven o'clock. Park the car around the block, then I walk to the spot. Walked around with the patio, let that 40 blast. Through the glass, shot the pit bull, didn't stand a chance. I heard, come and get the static if you please. I turned around, seen him across the hall, he shot me in my knees. <laughs> Laid out flat, them bullets burn. Now my family got a choice, should it be casket or herb? We never learned. Toxic calls on toxic lines. We sell toxic cups of wine. This ain't the life, it ain't the time. This is just God's unholy vine. It's a humorless fucking joke. Oh man. Whoa. <laughs> um there's like a couple lines in that song that are exactly what happened exactly what happened don't want to get set up north oh really honestly are you reading my mind did you read like the book of my life already whoa like i'm gonna have to listen to that three or four times oh that that was crazy that was pretty crazy i don't want to say okay. a lot after reacting to this I, you know, I just want to say thank you because um, that was like what happened between the two of us was by far, in a way, one of the most painful things that has ever happened to me and ever will happen to me. And um, if you get, you know, to stay alive, to make art, to make art more than anything, you know, how can you not be a happy person? Well, I don't, I don't want to say how can you not be a happy person. Maybe you're not always going to be happy, but you're going to be thankful. So, you know, I'm grateful. I'm grateful uh, to even be able to be a writer. I'm grateful to YJ. I'm grateful to my YouTube family. So, thank you, YJ. You know, I wish you eternal acceleration. Eternal acceleration. And I wish for you whatever it is that you really, 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 really want. Okay? And thank you for ever coming into my circle of knowing. Honestly, you're amazing. Bye. I look forward to reading everyone's comments. And if you would kindly consider subscribing to my channel. The link is below this video, as well as the bell that you can hit to receive all future notifications for the content that I'm creating. In the description box below, you'll find the links to all of my social media, as well as all of the reference points for YJ, and a link to the Facebook home team hangout where we keep everybody entertained and motivated. We'd love to see you there and take care of yourself, be peaceful, and be kind and gentle. Much love. Bye-bye.